Deep Packet Inspection or DPI is an advanced form of packet filtering that examines and manages network traffic. It is helpful in tracking which applications are using the most bandwidth, offering clear visualized data to facilitate better management and network traffic distribution. This video will guide you through configuring DPI via the Omada SDN controller. Go to Settings, Network Security, Application Control, Deep Packet Inspection. Enable Deep Packet Inspection. Note that a gateway is required to enable the function. Enable logging traffic as well to allow the device to collect and save the results of traffic analysis, so that you can check the result on the Statistics Application Analytics page. Apply the settings. Go to Rules Management. Here you can peer define one or more rules to control traffic of different applications within a time period. Specify a name for the defined rule. Select a time range profile to specify the time period when the rule takes effect. If you haven't had any time range profile yet, click Create Time Range Entry here to create a new one. You can also click Manage Time Range Entries to go to the Time Range page for further configuration. You can choose whether to enable QoS or not. If QoS is enabled, select the QoS class from the drop-down list, and the data flows will be limited according to the corresponding QoS class. You can click Manage QoS class for further QoS settings. If QoS is disabled, the traffic of the applications selected under the rule will then be blocked. Select the applications to apply the rule. Click Apply to save the rule. Here we also create a rule with QoS disabled to block the selected applications. Other rules can be created through the same process. After defining the rules you need to add them to an application filter for restriction assignment. Go to Application Filter. Click Create New Application Filter. Specify a name for the filter. You can also give a brief description of the filter to demonstrate its purpose. Select one or more rules for the filter. Here you can edit the existing rules or add new rules as well. Click Create to create the application filter. Go back to the Deep Packet Inspection page and click Create New Assign Restriction. Select a network and apply the predefined filter. Click Confirm to save the settings. Now DPI has been configured. Let's see the analytical results. Go to Statistics Application Analytics. Here you can specify the time range and view the total network traffic and the respective proportion in different categories. In the Categories tab, you can monitor the traffic of specific categories. In the Apps tab, you can check the details of each application. Allow apps. Refer to those with QoS enabled or not added to the rules. Block apps are those with QoS disabled. Click the Details icon in the Action column. You can find the network traffic information of the specific application for different users. The Users tab offers analytical results for each user connected to the network. Go to the Details and you can check the network traffic usage of all the applications in the selected user, providing you with clear charts and data to better manage and monitor your network. If you want to clear the DPI data of a time period, go to the Deep Packet Inspection page. Click Clear Data and specify the period. After the operation, all the data of the specified period on the Application Analytics page will be discarded.